making sure there's no angle for an engage on the smolder. Mom gonna get called over the top, just knocks the edge of night off of Sniper. The Root is gonna connect, and FBI does have to flash out of there. There's no devour from Huhi. It's not available, and maybe there's an angle to get oh. something done. River though, oh, the oh shit! Oh, it's gonna take him across the map. Where did he go? 100 Thieves get pulled on a wild ride there by Douglas. It's a double coming through for FBI. It's a triple for FBI. It's a quadra for FBI. He wants the Penta, and he's going to get it. And Energy will end the game. Farm right now is the top lane, but both junglers hanging around. Yeah, they they go. Nice seismic shove coming out, and Quinn is dead. And JoJo just typed regular season matters. Good job. How willing he is to go for the 1v1, like even sacrificing his lane at times Ooh. to be uh, as Quinn? I think he's dead. Oh! Yep. JoJo continues his all chat uh, regular season team ja 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 right after that <laughs> second solo kill. And making the most of it in the mid game around the map. Nice, That's Quinn going in, and Ayla's ready to follow up right behind him for the lockdown. Spiraling despair. This way is going to be able to do. They bridge that line. Ready to answer into that tier one fight. turret. But here comes Hunter Thieves. Ayla ain't gonna find the dredge line, but Rivers here in the front with a crescent sweep as soon as the fight starts. JoJo types second place team so good, but he's clearly <laughs> typing with such speed and passion that half of the words are misspelled. Berserker's got the range to keep poking on the thing. Dredge line hits a minion. Ayla hits the ground. Blabber popping the clone to immediately get out of there as River jumps in with the dance of arrows. But there's Berserker's calling. Ayla loses about one third HP. <laughs> River has to flash over the wall, oh no! That was not what they wanted to do! Ayla just got fast food delivered, we went into the fight, and now JoJo's already found the pop blossom! The Blast Comb of Doom coming up for Ayla, oh, no. yeah, who definitely did not want to go into the fight there. It was not laughing about it. A double-digit goalie to 22 minutes, you feel invincible. Yeah. And I think you might as well be Berserker. I'm looking forward to seeing more of that from JoJo in the series. Uh-oh, Sniper drops the Equalizer going in after Fudge, but he doesn't realize Blabber's already waiting on him. Sniper! Hi, uh, C9's back. Oh, C9's so good, guys. How was Meech Berserker this series? <laughs> oh my gosh, well... That is massive, Umti comes in right at the right time and there's another fight mid. Teleport from Impact, tries to join the fight. Whipple already flashed in to try to guarantee the kill onto Yon. He finds it, Impact is there, finds revenge. Masu pinned against the wall. Inspired Chunk comes in, tries to save Masu. He's still alive, he's kiting this one out. Masu is still hitting and no one is hitting it back. Umti tries to find it. Quadra for Masu. <laughs> <laughs> This into match. the ring. Jensen has so much experience. The, the analyst was... <laughs> oh my god! They were just 6,000 gold up, and the trash talk <laughs> continues from APA. <laughs> That's a lot of damage. Weaver's Wall is going to come through the mid lane. They're going to try to cut off impact. He has flash available. What does Jensen do? Okay, he dashes over the wall. Not gonna That's connect. 12 seconds later. From the uh -oh. veteran, but... Okay, he dashes through, but he gets clipped by ah! the unraveled <laughs> Earth! I can't believe this guy's typing so much. Like, it's <laughs> actually like, I've never seen like a bad player oh, type so much. Blocked. Impact uh, is looking a little cooked here. In he has fire. W, but has he's... Flash. Uh, he's out one? the W, one there one, it is! Please. Yeah! Oh, one auto attack, actually. <laughs> <laughs> So far, FlyQuest kind of rocking. Oh, Jensen's gonna fire out the Spiraling Despair. It's a teleport coming in from Whippo. AP has a But he solo kills Jensen before Whippo gets there. And if Impact can get there in time, he can bail out APA out of a bad situation. He's out of there. I heard him I, heard, I heard the typing as well. Maybe we'll get to see it, but um, <laughs> playing worse uh -oh. more than APA is. Oh, the Flash W doesn't connect on the APA. He still has a Flash. The Satchel right. Charge gets him out of range. The Nautilus is not gonna be strong. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, well, Deja Vu, APA has no flash, and Busio doesn't have the ulti, but they've cut him off from his escape route, so he's just gonna farm up the minion wave. No way for APA to get out. The Spiraling Despair is gonna take him out in the end. And FlyQuest, they finally got him. Impact, separated from the rest of the squad here. Doesn't have all out, so he can't go over the wall point yet, so he positions for Inspired. 
couldn't wait. actually hit very wait. hard. He's gonna find Masu. So much HP! Oh! Impact. Soaks up a lot of the damage already. Spiraling Despair thrown down into the top laner. MT looking for the kick into the core change in Magnet Storm! That was huge from Team Liquid, but can they carry this fight? Inspired is looking for the reset, but doesn't find it as the stasis from Yawn keeps him safe. Team Liquid just found a crucial play in the second game of the series. So this TL bottom lane is looking good. I always love it when the bottom lane gets kills in 2v2s, but also when they play safe. Him? Yes. <laughs> I mean, JJ still has flash, but he Sorry. gets turned up. Kobe, how could you? Oh my God. Team Liquid fans are out in force for Kobe as Yon is also going to get caught out as well. Damned if you talk about them. The charge in combat power right now. Oh, okay. I thought he was going to steal that for sure. Umti was trying to steal it, but they're pulling them all away from the, the Herald item itself. Cataclysm right on top of Umti and Core JJ. Umti is trying to flash away towards the right side where the rest of Team Liquid is waiting. Oh! Here the APA Nico special. This is what he made a name for himself last summer in the LCS. He went for the early seekers. Oh, he's is typing. He able to make it happen. Oh. oh, the live view of him typing. <laughs> he said, wow, the ego. <laughs> He's level 17. Well, wait, the blast gun just punts Whippo right back into APA. He's forced to use the pop up, so he doesn't even go on. This could be a banger level one. They spot each other, so I think we'll probably back off. But Busio's, he might have to level E. He's got a level E. Uh oh. Busio's in trouble. Too late. Phantom Undertow, it is too late. Bye! What convinced you to allow Busio to play Pike? And after we see that level one, will you ever let him do it again? I don't saw that. Did Busio die at level one? Oh, uh, I mean, I didn't really feel it, but the player's thought it was a good idea, so, yeah. It's a good thing, I think, that <laughs> they... Oh, my God. <laughs> Look at this. Wow, you're right in those domes. <laughs> Very threatening through the regular season. Those were best of ones, but it's even showing up in the best of fives in the upper Equalizer bracket. Equalizer on the Jensen. Stand strong. Using stasis from APA. Jensen is gone. Teleport comes in from Quipo. Remember, he doesn't have flash from before. Cosmic Radius is going to come in. They try to save Impact and Lone but they get first and down. Busio with the flash. Tries to look for APA. He flashes backward. Yon okay, is free oh. hitting. Look at Freon. He's got cleanse and he's got flash still available, but he's cutting this one out. The flash from his partner trying to connect the stun, but the charm from APA keeps him alive. Yon flashes backward, but the resets are poor again. The arrow from Bonsu. Is this it? Okay, oh, we can end. We can end. We can end. We can end. The game is over. Can, the game is over. Can, can Oh, so I mean, I think I had a lot of good moments and I was like consistently like doing better than APA. I mean, he wasn't he wasn't playing super well either. So that made it a bit easier for me. There's a lot of trash talking in the doll chat. Was it taking focus away? No, I mean, I thought it's funny, but it, it is taking focus away a bit because I, it's really hard to focus when like a bad player is talking shit. Like if it was a good player, I wouldn't mind so much, but it is a bit weird. Best advice someone has given to you. Uh, just have fun and enjoy, and enjoy the moment. Who gave you that advice? Myself. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? Uh, get any sort of lead and... Oh, oh, flash forward. Tries to actually hit the blast cone, but here comes Quid. Yep, that's me. And now Contract is locked in the wall. It's like shooting fish in a barrel. Gonna try to dash forward. There comes the charm from Palafox. Is gonna connect, but Contract's getting very low. The red buff blocks the shock blast from Sniper. And here comes Dokla, but Dokla's already very low. Pathmaker forward, gonna force the flash. The Dawning Shadow comes in over the top. Palafox is looking, and that barrel combo did connect, so Sniper could be in trouble. River gonna try to get in here. A nice dodge there on the charm as Palafox was guessing, and he gets wrong. Well, they're stacking here, and they're gonna look for a River. Contract goes in, pops the crest. And guard in goes Palafox to try to follow it up. Looking at Nocturne's runes, and he's actually not running Ultimate Hunter this game. Mm. And I guess if you're just never pressing your ultimate, you don't have to worry <laughs> about the cooldown on it. The light's gonna get turned off though. Are they gonna go in with this? Dokla split from the team, but the rest of the, uh, the squad is all together and Contrax is going forward. Is it gonna be a flip again? Can Contrax pull it off? Oh. He can't. Contrax is looking like he's gonna fall. The smite secured there this time by River, and the first kill goes the way of 100 Thieves. They want more. Flash in from Alyss. The crash down. It's the magic. Storm, and it's the end of NRG as 100 Thieves pile in. It's a triple already for Quid. Is he going to get the Quadra? Of course he is. The first thing I wanted to ask Quid, how are you so good at this game? Oh, oh I just play a lot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Team Liquid picking up the crab here first. Not trying to hard force anything here just yet, but Core JJ makes the engage. Oh. Magnet Storm and immediate follow up from APA. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You have to wonder if it's like, oh, wait, wait. hold on. Rich flashing away here oh. with the falling star. He gets the outplay. I mean, he was playing a great game. That's his first death. <laughs> <laughs>
age-old tale. Cool but day. now, you're in the mid lane. Core JJ, what are you doing? Core's in a bit of a strange spot. Strange spot. He's still going to be kept alive. The skies descend, and Dig will end. It's Yon grabbing one. Yon gets two. There's another one coming in. They're about to burn away. A triple quadra. It's Smolder, baby. Playing it. I think really well with the pressure that he has. Full 1v1 in top side. Rich in Dominus mode. Impact dropping his own ulti here. One more auto attack's all he needs, but he can't quite oh! find it. Yes, he does! Impact! He waited a second, he was hesitant. Oh, <laughs> the frustration on his face. Yeah, good job, guys. You guys play great this game. Very yeah. aggressive. Very good. Very happy. GG. GG! You had a lot of fans in the crowd. There's a lot of people that have been cheering you guys on. We even had an XU corner if you guys are out here with your signs and everything. Right in the back. Any message for them out there that were cheering you the entire season? I mean, that's my family, so shout out to them. Uh, <laughs> thank you guys for coming and watching me get swept. Um, I appreciate it. <laughs> Maybe next time you guys don't come and I'll win, so. Uh, <laughs> I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding.